Um, so guys, everyone knows 2016 sucked, but you know, 2017 is going to be a better year. Now that that generic intro is out of the way, let's get started. Um, disclaimer, as I clean my glasses, um, there's no good mic today. Just thought I'd let you know. My first New Year's resolution is to be more for others. What I meant when I wrote that at the time, I have no clue. I've always been one of those people who really considers how a situation or decision um, affects themselves personally and doesn't really consider um, how it affects others. And so 2017, um, I really wanted to try and change that. Um, a lot of the time I'll do things for my own benefit rather than considering how it affects other people. And I don't think that's really, I don't think that's good. I challenged a lot of my relationships in the last 12 months um, because of this thinking pattern and really put a strain on a lot of close connections that I should have with people. So I want to change that. The next one is health. I really want to focus on my mental and physical health. It's really simple. Like mental, um, I need to talk to a therapist rather than venting to my friends because that's not good for their mental health. It's not good for mine. And uh, for my body, I just want to eat better. Like, side note, I just had pizza for dinner, but then again, um, I just drove four hours in a car to get from Toronto to here, so, um, I didn't feel like making anything, but that's another thing, laziness, I don't, it, I have to fight the laziness when it comes to eating well, I'm like yelling at you, but I'm really yelling at me. The next one is to change my vocabulary, there's two reasons behind this, the first one is, um, get it personal. I use very aggressive terminology. So when I'm like upset, I'm angry and I feel aggressive. But when I'm happy, I'm just I'm just happy. And so I feel like by me having more words to describe it when I'm in a bad mood versus when I'm in a good mood actually makes me more inclined to be in a bad mood because I'd be saying these negative words more often. I don't know if this makes sense, but I'm going to try it out. And the second part is I just want to speak better. Wow, great start. I want to be able to have a conversation with someone and not feel, I don't want to feel stupid because I can't use the same jargon that they can. And this comes with my writing mostly because I'm in philosophy and every time I write a paper, I don't feel smart enough or I don't feel as smart as other people just because I can't use the same words as them. So that's another thing I want to fix. Um... Believe it or not, as a film student, I actually don't watch a lot of movies. Um, this this became evident to me over this holiday. I need to fix that because as a film person, I should probably know a thing or two about movies or have seen them at least. I have so many books that I brought home from Toronto and you know what? I spend money on them, so I'm going to actually read them. I'm one of those people who starts books and never finishes them, so it's more of I need to finish a book rather than start more. And the last resolution, weekly videos. Mic drop. But that's all for my New Year's resolution. Um, 2016 was actually really great, not gonna lie. Met a lot of cool people, did a lot of cool things, so I'm actually not upset about how my year turned out, but that doesn't mean that there's no room for improvement. So as the great Disney movie once said, Keep moving forward. I feel like there should be more to that line, but there's not, so that's it. Goodbye. <laughs>